Xavier. Xavier Cooks. The Aussie. The man from Victoria. Is it Ballarat? To be specific, played high school ball at Holy Spirit College and then went to Winthrop here in America. Went undrafted. Played for the Il Illawarra Hawks. And then he, he's played basically, I mean, he started off with the Illawarra Hawks, but when he came back, he played in, after college, he played in Germany. Then he's been on the Sydney Kings, all right? And the best part is, is this is a guy who just, who you know, won MVP. He's a dog. He's an emerging player. Just went on. Okay, he had the first triple-double since 2021, since Dante Draper did it. Now coming over to the U.S. Shout out, guess what? I'm with I'm a Wizards fan, and the thing is, is that he's now coming over here, and he's joining this team, and I really think Xavier Cooks could be a guy. He's going to come over after the NBA Finals, but he's a guy who could definitely make an impact for our squad. He's going to be the deals for the rest of this year and for next season, and he averaged 16 points a night here, 33% from the three for the Sydney Kings. Um, he did play for the Wellington Saints last year in the New Zealand League, but he dominated there, but it was a lesser league. But again, he looks like a guy who could be kind of, you know, a two-way 3 and D rotational role player for the the Wizards. And with that being said, let's just talk about it. So Adrian Wojnarowski said the Wizards are signing Kings forward Xavier Kings, MVP of the National Basketball League in Australia, to a deal through the 2023-24 season. His agent, Daniel Moldovan of Octagon Sports, tells ESPN, Cooks will join the Wizards as soon as the Kings, you know, complete play. In the NBA Finals this week, comes the NBA on a contract by him, comes the fifth player in five years to make the leap from that organization to the NBA. Shout out Jacques Landell, Jay Sean Tate, Tory Craig, all the guys who have came over in the last few years from the NBL and have been making impacts. I've been telling you, if you're a young guy and you're trying to go somewhere, okay, go, go, go and play in Australia, it's really good league to 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 build up your your stature. Um, for me, I think he's a guy that is going to have an impact here for the Wizards and going to help us make a playoff push. And he's six foot eight. He's a great switchable, versatile defender. He's got good passing skills. Twenty seven. He's a guy. He's an outstanding player. And we knew that the Kings front office has former Grizzlies executive. Chris Pongrass and Andrew Bogan and Luke Longley, and they've all been talking about it. And the Cooks has played for Chase Buford, the son of R.C. Buford, and a former coach of the year in the NBA G League with the Wisconsin Herd, who led Sydney to a title. And the Wizards are the 10th spot right now in the East, 30 and 33. So it's a it's a big move for us because, I mean, obviously, you know, a guy like him could really, really help us out and be a difference maker. But... I want to hear your guys' thoughts. What are you guys on the same page as me, thinking that he could make this this impact? That it seems like he could be this multi-positional defender. We need more wing guys. That's a fact. Like you're lying if you don't think that. And I personally think this is something that could work out great for us. And my opinion is, I want to hear your guys' thoughts. What do you think he's gonna do? And do you think how many minutes he's gonna get play? I think he can fit in really nice because you can play shooting guard small forward maybe even some power forward you kind of be like this multi-positional player for us that i think could be way better than people are expecting because in my opinion it sounds amazing on paper but the implement i, I also think west on sells a better coach but imagine this guy next to like denny avdia christoph Porzingis, kyle kuzma bradley beal and like I guess it would be Monte Morris or Kendrick Nunn or DeLon Wright. Like that DeLon Wright in there. That would be a huge lineup. Like the length of that team would be absurd. I, I don't even know how people would be able to defend that length. And that for me, I think that could be dangerous. All right. And I, I want to hear your guys' thoughts down below. What do you guys think? And if you guys are on the same page as me, like, comment, subscribe. And let me know if there was anything I might have missed that you guys wanted to hear. But hey. This is awesome. I'm excited to see this guy get his shot in the NBA because he deserves it. And it's going to be really cool to see him have the success because you know what? He's a player. He's a baller, okay? And Xavier Cooks is going to have a good career. The Aussie himself. All right. So have a good one, guys. Like, comment, subscribe, do all that good jazz. I'm going to go now. Bye-bye.